Welcome, welcome back Cake Vlog family. Thank you so much for tuning in. Today is cake delivery and setup day. If you've been following along with the previous videos, we baked, made decorations, assembled the cake. Now it's time to go set up at the venue. I have my cart here, which I'm gonna to use to place everything that I'll be going with. But first, let me tackle this mess. This is the aftermath from decorating the cake the night before. We're gonna clean this up, pack everything we need, and head on over to the venue. It's at For Judy, 473 Grenada Boutique Resort. Do you guys know that location? It's my first time going there. Leave a comment below and let me know. Those of you who are new, my name is Jade. I run a home-based cake decorating business. I'm also a stay-at-home mom. And I try my best to share with you videos at least once a week, showing you behind the scenes footage of what it is being a cake decorator. So please, if you like this sort of content and you enjoy the video, pause for a moment, hit the like button, subscribe, become a part of the cake vlog family. All right, so here is a before shot of what the workspace looks like and I just placed everything back where it belongs. So now let's go ahead and get the items that I'm gonna need to set up the cake at the venue. Leave a comment below and let me know what sort of items you normally take with you when you go to set up your cakes. I always like hearing from you guys, so don't hesitate to leave a message. If you have any suggestions, feel free to share. By the way, I got the cart off of Amazon. If you're interested, I'll have it linked in the description box below. Okay guys, so I think I have everything I need. The last set of items I have to pack would be like my purse and my camera, which I'm using now, my phone, you know, things like that. So I have some food grade alcohol, the edible gold, brushes some water, royal icing, my small knife, gold flakes, my needle, my brush so that I can dust off some extra piping bag with these fondant smoother battery and an extra memory card. I'm gonna go ahead and pack this. See you soon. I forgot to mention I also walked with this cake stand in case they wanted to place the cake on it but because of the layout of everything it wasn't possible to use it you're gonna see later in the video. All of my tools are packed. I'm gonna go get ready. See you in a bit. All right, so I'm ready. Let me just show you what it looks like in the back of the van where I place the cakes. Not sure if any of you do this, but I usually place the non-skid mat below the boxes so that it doesn't move around. If this is something you do, share with me in the comment section below. Or if you have any other methods that work for you, let me know. I would love to hear. All right, so it's time to hit the road. This part makes me really anxious. If you know, you know. Our roads are not the best and there are so many corners. So yeah, my anxiety level from the time I leave home to the venue, it's always up there. <laughs> Can any of you relate to that? In my previous video, I spoke about my fear of dropping a cake. Another fear of mine is getting to the location and when I open the box, the cake is ruined. Oh, I don't know how I'm gonna deal with that. Any tips you guys have for transportation of cakes, share with me, let me know, anything would help. By the way, thank you so much for your feedback on the last video. It really motivates me to know that you're enjoying the content that I share. I hope the videos are helpful to you. I'm just doing my best, taking things one day at a time, managing being a mom and a self-employed business owner. So yeah, I'm glad you enjoy the content. If you recognize any of the places we drove by on the way to the venue, leave a comment below. I asked this in my last video. Have you guys made any goals for the new year? Anything you want to achieve? Any changes you want to make? If so, and you don't mind sharing, let me know in the comment section. Let me know some of what you hope to achieve in the year 2021.
All right guys, so we're almost there. Look at this, this place is a hidden gem. Grenada is so beautiful, guys. We're so blessed to be living in paradise, right? Guys, we're finally here. Okay guys, we have arrived. I'm just gonna go in and get some directions before we offload everything. I forgot my mask. I swear, because I hardly go places, every time I go somewhere, I forget my mask. Let me know in the comment section, does this happen to you as well or am I the only one? <laughs> This is nice, very tranquil. I hope I'm in the right entrance. Hello, where the entrance is here? From here? Okay, thank you. Hello, afternoon. This is where the cake is going to set up. Yes. This here? Yeah, the first one. Check this out guys, isn't this a sight to behold? If you've never been to this resort, you're welcome. I'm giving you a bit of the experience now. <laughs> Right, so now that I know where we're setting up the cake, I'm gonna go back to the van, get everything out, and start assembling the cake. Have a look at the process. I'll show you an overview of everything once I'm done. So the customer that I did this cake for was kind enough to share with me some of the shots that she got on her birthday. Thank you so much if you're looking at this video. So stay tuned to the end to see how they turned out. Okay guys, so the cake is set up already. Here's what it turned out like. Such a beautiful venue. And this is what the event planners did from hangers, weddings, and events. They did this lovely setup. Let's take in some of the scenery before we leave. Guys, so there you have it. Our very first cake delivery and setup here on the YouTube channel. Look forward to many more. Ensure you're subscribed so you don't miss a beat. Hit the like button, leave a comment. As usual, I appreciate you. Thank you so much for watching. Remember, live your dreams and create a life that you want for yourself. Until next time, bye guys.